Concern by both teams. A lot of young players getting big minutes on these two teams, just like Syracuse and Florida. You made the point that they really look to each other. They really work with each other. For a young team coming off the kind of season they had last year and now with new players, uh, this team has played pretty doggone mm -hmm. good early in the season. A lot of ball handlers on the floor right now for Kansas. Collins, Taylor, Morningstar. Inside Morris, off the glass and good. Boy, those, those three kids inside are going to be about three kids as good as anybody in the country has on the same team. And the scary thing is one's a sophomore and the other two are fresh freshmen. Yeah. Under four. What a move by Isaiah Thomas, and you can see how, against a lot of opponents this year, he's going to put up some big numbers. A timeout on the court with 3.52 to go. Kansas leading by 16. Clutch shot. Michael Jordan shot in 82. Gets the most votes. Mario Chalmers is second. Keith Smart is fourth. So you got to log on. You're not a log on kind of guy, are you? You know, I, I just kind of look at it this way. I probably know a lot more about it than most people that voted. <laughs> I think so that's I'll, fair. I'll just stay with what I thought. <laughs> okay. I'm not going to argue that point. There were certainly some unbelievable moments, whether it was 82, 83, 87, or, or just this past April. Collins driving again. And again, using... The bulk of the shot clock. The Jayhawks are really running it down now on the Huskies. You know, Washington is still working hard defensively. They haven't changed at all on defense. Now, there again is that foot quickness that Aldridge has. He came from one side of the lane across the bucket and got the tip in. Brockman's tired. Mm -hmm. Brockman's just worked his tail off, and he's just tired. I'd get Brockman out of there so he's going to be able to play tomorrow night. He has played 32 of the 37 minutes. Meanwhile, Aldridge has been a star tonight. All right, here's that, that move inside with the little hook shot that he has. Here's another move to the bucket. Uh, gets the block. I mean... If, uh, boy, it, let me put it this way. If there is a better potential center in the country than Aldridge, I don't know about it. 12 points, 9 rebounds, 6 blocks for Cole Aldridge. And then with big kids that move like he does, Dan, there's no statistic that enables you to really gauge his effectiveness with people dropping back on him on the offensive end, opening up other people, or, or guys being reluctant to drive against him or they alter their shots. Just his presence with his quickness uh, is a tremendous asset without him ever touching the ball at either end. And we talked about how Washington's not getting the ball into Brockman a lot. The KU guards are doing a, a really nice job of finding Aldrich on the inside. There it is again. Now being 6'11 helps. Being able to do things like that help as he'll get back to the line. Meanwhile, Brockman not having the same kind of night, although he's ripping down rebounds like crazy. Well, he, he's going inside, and, and he just isn't getting the openings that I'm sure he's used to in, in Kansas. Kansas obviously has, has targeted uh, Brockman as the focal point of their defense. But what we, what we just saw from Aldridge there is something that you rarely talk about. He has a long, quick step, and he just showed it right there. He, he moves, he keeps his pivot foot there without uh, walking violation, but then when he moves to the bucket, he takes a long step, and it's hard to defend. Well, Brockman, one of the Huskies who goes out, he's presumably done for the night, will rest up a little bit for tomorrow night when it looks like Washington will play Florida. Now, Florida has young, athletic front court players, but none of them has anywhere near the physical strength or the bulk that Brockman has. And as opposed to Aldridge, who's 6'11", the Florida front court guys are all about 6'8". You know, Aldridge is 6'11", is, is augmented by quick feet. Really good footwork on both both ends of the floor. And, you know, that kid isn't going to do anything but get better. 18-point lead for Kansas on their way to a meeting with Syracuse in the championship game tomorrow night. Looking like Florida and Washington in the third-place game. And it bounds off Aldridge. And from Turner back into the game for Washington now. Kansas with two lopsided wins over lesser opposition coming in. Washington with a loss tonight will drop to 2-2 two and two on the season. Turner, quick trigger from the corner. Tyrell Reed brings down the rebound. From Taylor. 
you know, 